BNN's coverage of the Class of 2023 is sponsored by Missy Pyle with Benchmark Realty. Missy's desire to help others comes to life through her integrity, hard work, and dedication as a realtor. If you're looking to buy or sell or just have questions about the market, call Missy Pyle with Benchmark Realty. I, when I went to the college I'm going to, Memphis, it's like what they do there is the same what, what, we, what we do here. You know, we work out, go have practice, come back in, have film, and that's like, that's all before school and during first block. So it's like, people don't know that we wake up like at 5.30 in the morning, 6 a.m. in the morning. And I say it's like a dedication. You got to be dedicated to come every morning, every afternoon, whenever you're going to practice, do the game. And one thing they do a really good job of is like in the summer, whenever nobody wants to come, you could be out at the pool with the lake. They do a really good job of incorporating everybody and kind of like, you, you got to be there, you got to put in the work, but you're going to have fun either way. It doesn't matter what you do, what position you are, you're going to have fun. Like having like our, our history is just like, it's so, it's so powerful and so rich that like, like Mount Julius itself is just a good program to be in because of the history, the people around it, the coaches, the players, they understand the end goal in mind. So it's just, that's just a good thing to be around. I feel like, especially us three coming from different schools, I feel like we can say confidently, like, especially in Wilson County, if there's a school you want to go to for football and you want to win, and even on top of football, just the school and the environment overall, like, this is a place to be. Yeah, it really is. The last regular season game at Green Hill? Yeah, the, the atmosphere, the energy, the student sections, both sides. I mean, it was just absolutely amazing, but also, we corrected something that shouldn't have been needed to be correcting. Yeah, yeah. Like we went in there knowing what the outcome was going to be. And so part of it was acting like we already knew what the outcome was going to be. Yeah. I was on cloud nine. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. But yeah. also I had a sense that we, that we were supposed to do that both years really. But mm -hmm. my favorite memory would be like just the brotherhood we all like have with each other. Like after games, after, after, no matter if we get pounded or if we win by 60, we all hang out, like go to beat ups, Buffalo Wild Wings, just hang out. I think that's one of the best times of my life. Like I've known him since um, we were probably like, what, seven? You know, growing up at the park, playing football, um, just since I was five, I naturally know so, so, much, like so many of these guys and it's gonna be hard leaving them whenever you've known them for so long and also like, being in the locker room with them day in and day out, just having to leave that setting and go to a different one, it's going to be hard.